Um, so these are different modules that I, um, I always, whenever I, I, I write a Python file, I always import these. Um, is OS, which is, uh, it handles file path manipulation. So, and, a, and another one is called Glob. Uh, what this OS and Glob allow you to do is you can, um, from within your Python folder, get lists of files from different directories. Um, and you can actually remove files, you can copy files all within your Python script. Uh, and so it's very useful for formatting data sets that way, or like renaming images or, or moving them to, to new uh, locations. Uh, NumPy, as I mentioned before, um, it is really great for working with multi-dimensional arrays. Um, images can be thought of as three-dimensional arrays, uh, and where your height, your width, and then your channel dimension. Uh, and typically, if we are feeding images into a neural network, there'll be a fourth dimension called batch size, which just indicates the number of images. Um, so typically, you'll have four-dimensional image volumes that you're kind of, that you're dealing with um, in neural networks. Uh, Matplotlib is a plotting function. You don't necessarily have to use it, uh, but you can. Um, I should also mention that uh, typically, like for you guys since everybody uses Windows, you only have to do import matplotlib.pyplot as plot, and this is just giving you access to the plotting functions where you can visualize images, you can uh, plot time series data. Um, this, these two commands are something that's unique to Mac because um, of, it has to do with the graphics backend uh, for Mac computers, um, so just to keep that in mind. Uh, math is a library that just allows you to access things like cosine, sine, like basic mathematic functions. Um, PDB is your best friend module. Uh, it's your debugging module. Uh, so this is the, as I said in cap, caps, the most useful module ever. Uh, and I'll show you guys how to use that in this, um, in this program. 